What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Bam and Ty. Look, today, well, I started to do starter locks. I'm going on a dreadlock journey. You feel me? I got the little oil sliding down my scalp, but right now, I got baby blocks, you know? I decided to, you know, try a new look. I've done waves, I've done curls, I've done braids, high top fade, man bun. I've done everything, but I have not tried locks. So today, I decided to get my hair, you know, styled up. I have to show you, like, when it's not styled, how it actually looks without the um, protective style. I put it like this because I work out a lot. And when I'm running my hair, when I do a retwist, it gets frizzy and it ruins my, my appointment. Pretty much I pay for nothing. So I can still work out like this, put my do-rag on, work out. And when I'm sleeping, I sleep with a bonnet because I don't want to mess up my, or flatten any hair. So that's what it looked like. Mm -hmm. uh, I've only been locked for like one month. This is only one month of me being locked. My hair is only like three inches long. So it's not really, it's not really, really long. More hair looking hair. I don't know like where to look, but <laughs> I'm gonna look right here. But it's, what you call it? Um, yeah, this is my starter lock. I use uh, I use vitamin E oil. You know, use vitamin E oil for my hair, and I use it for my beard too, cause you know, grow my beard out, try something different, new look, new image. Uh, what I do is actually, you know, I mix all my oils. I put all my oils in here for my uh, for my locks. So I got vitamin E, castor oil whole bunch of good stuff in here, you know? And I just sprayed in my scalp, you know? Just, just sprayed in my scalp. Probably do it like twice a week. But right now, I'm finna keep my hair, I'm, I'm finna see how long can I keep my hair locked for. I wanna see how long I can keep it styled. Maybe for like two months without a retwist. But right now, this is only like one month lock. I got I got some budding right now too. I got some budding. But what you guys think? How many starter lock people out there? Do I have any starter lock people? Who's with me? It's only one month that we started. It's not bad though. Kind of tight, but it's, the journey is enjoy the beginning stage because a year from now they gonna probably be down here. Two years from now. Boy, I'm gonna have some hang time. But for right now, you know, you're starting off with progress. That's an oily slide. I'm finna jump in the shower though, because I gotta get, you know, ready for the day. But I just wanna show you guys something quick. This what it look like. So, yes, it don't matter how small, uh, how small your hair is, it can get your hairstyle with starter locks. So, I might name this video Styling Your Starter Locks with Short locks but yeah or not i'm gonna think of something but i don't really know what to call this video it's just an update showing you guys my starter locks for all the lock kids out there yeah. but yeah it's progress my first video about my locks hope you guys like it man got the cut too you know had to get the fresh cut some people like cut the locks off right here. Like they cut it off so they can have that hairline in the front. I don't want to do that. I want to keep my locks in the front. I don't want to cut anything off. Maybe I might in the future, but for now, I just got the taper, taper, and I have my back at the bottom. Like, I don't know if you can see, but I have my back at the bottom faded. I got like a small fade, not too much, but. So my hang time will be crazy though. This is a progress. And also for other people, some people like, if they want to speed up their process, you can also, you know, you go in there and just poke at them. But when it's not styled though, you go ahead and use a crochet needle. And you just, you know, lock it up. But some people say it comes with, you know, some good things, bad things, like it causes gaps. Or like your locks will be different sizes. Once you grow out long, you just have to keep doing the same method. But 
sometimes when I'm bored, I poke at it, but it speeds the locking process up. So when you do get a retwist, you ain't got to worry about your ends unraveling every time you get a wash. But I'm going to go ahead and see how long this lasts, you guys, because you know, I'm digging the locks. I'm digging it. I got some extra hair on the side. I need to be trimmed down, but my hair grows pretty fast. I got my vitamin E oil. I heard that, you know, stimulates growth. Not all oil works on your scalp. Like, I use a lot of African oil, but I guess, like, it didn't work good with me. So, I have to go to vitamin E. I had to go to, like, pink lotion bottle conditioner. Those work good on me, too. And what else? I got, like, I don't know. I just be having a whole lot of different, you know, oils. I've been, I'm experimenting with a lot of oils right now to make sure, to find out what do I like, what do I want. For my hair texture, my hair type. I don't even know what kind of hair type I have. Like, comment down below what kind of hair, what hair type you think I might have? Because I don't, I don't know what hair type I have. But this is my starter locks. I'm one month in. I'm gonna show you guys my second month or my two week progress, my next month progress. I'm gonna show you my uh, third month progress. We're gonna show you the whole year, pretty much how I started off. So you guys, so those out there who's doing starter locks just like me, we can go on a journey together. So we gonna have a progress. I'm gonna show you my progress. We gonna show you, and then, um, what you call it? Yeah, we can go for there. I really don't know what to say. <laughs> it just locks, but um, it also, you know, helps build patience, I heard too. So, enjoy the process. The, I kind of skipped the ugly phase. So, instead of just having it all wild, I style it. If you don't like, if you always got something to do with and you always got to look nice, just style it. Just, other people, let them go through the ugly phase. They say, yeah, you got ugly phase because they choose to. You have an option to either let it be ugly or you can have it be styled. Choose what you want for your locks. So, and when I put oil on my scalp, sometimes, like, some oils make my scalp itchy. Not all oils make your scalp itchy. Like, this one is good. It's a lot of stuff in here. I kind of, I, I might tell you what's really in here, but I can't tell you all the sauce on the first video. But vitamin E is really a big factor when it comes to your uh, hair growth. Just for anything. Like, even with my facial hair, I, like, you know, I take some here. You know, I take some of my, my light spots. So, those, it's very hard for me to grow hair right here, but... It's coming in. As you can see, I finna grow a beard. You know, imagine my dream. Imagine the locks. It's long, right? It's the vision. Have a vision. The locks. Long. Beard. Mm. What? Bruh. I'm gonna look like a whole different person. But this is the look that we rocking with. Starter lock T. And if anybody got any tips, any journeys, anything you have going on with your locks as well. What's problems you dealing with when it's going to, like, I used to have a lot of problems going to bed with my uh, starter locks. Like, my locks would be flat in certain areas, uh, depending on how I lay, or, like, right now I got, like, a, a bonnet and I have, like, silky rags and stuff, because... I'm trying to figure out what works best for my hair, so I'm really experimenting with my hair texture. But yeah, let me let me know what you guys are going through as well with your starter locks, because this is what I'm going through with mine. And I wash my hair only probably twice or once. I think I really think I wash it once myself, and then other than that, only when I get my wash, I go to the shop. I get my hair done at the shop. I don't do my own rituals. You know, but yeah, started like my hair, like probably like this long. That's it, probably like this long. My hang time probably drops like down here. They don't touch down here yet. That's the goal. Get my shit down here. Probably by summertime. We don't know. I don't know how you know how long it's gonna grow, but sometime this year, the goal is down here. I want long dreads. I want them long, and I might color my tips. I'm not doing my whole head because it kills your your locks. I think that's what I hear. But if I find a healthy way of coloring my locks, I almost definitely would try it. But I don't think I would do the whole lock color. I would just do the tips and just rock it, you know? But yeah. 
other lock heads out there stay tuned with the update i love you guys peace